Hi everybody. Hello everyone. Uh, today we're going to uh, answer the question about water and whether we, whether or not we drink water. Because the question we often get asked, um, and well, mm. we we don't really have anything against water per se. We just don't really drink it. And uh, I think, um, yeah. It's because because everything we're eating is is is, is raw and fruit. Uh, it just means that we don't really need to drink water like normal people do. Um, so we we just eat eat, uh, eat fruit and mm. get enough liquid from that. Really, I suppose. Yes. Yeah. Well, I I started. Eat, I began eat just fruit without any knowledge of anything. Is it good for me? Blah, blah. No, nothing. I just want to eat fruit. I eat fruit. That was that simple as that. Nothing about it. Never read book about raw food. Not, nada. Nothing. So, what happened? I just started eating fruit when I decided to do so. And I realized I'm not thirsty. I don't need drink, so I didn't. And that's how it comes down to. And uh, then I realized, of course, the fruit is mainly water, just like our body, the percentage is almost equal, so it's obvious when I give, I have more moisture than anybody else because the food which is cooked and has salted, and I learn with my experience, especially salt and fat, um, it does not let uh, the dehydrates the body and grinds. So if, if you people who eat a lot of bread, a lot of salt, a lot of fat, they very, very thirsty. So the thirst depends on what do you eat, how much of of you eat. How much you how much of it you eat. <laughs> how much of it you eat no, yeah. Sometimes I tangled up myself and that's for me that, and I remember one of your friends, I won't name him because I don't know if he likes to be named or not. Um, he also mentioned to me a few months ago, my dear, or a bit, uh, that uh, he also went on the fruit alone and he noticed very soon, he's just done. Mm -hmm. You just lose your thirst, you're not thirsty. And if you are, you just... Yeah, I may get thirsty if I eat too many avocados, like till in one row, say in one hour after I get thirsty, I have fruit juice. Because water, I don't like to, I don't like drink water actually. No. So no. even if I fast, I have to drink water, mm. I take little sips. Yeah. I can't even have a half a glass at once. No, I find it very difficult to drink water too. Mm. I don't know why, just to... Mm. I, I just never appeals. I try and I, I drink a little bit, and it, it's enough for me just to mouth all. But it's very rare that we drink water anyway. Only when we fast. Yeah, if we fast. Yeah. And w one thing that we both have noticed, I think, is just you know when, when we were kids, uh, we're both of the same generation, obviously. And when we were kids, uh, it was very rare to see people walking around with water bottles. People didn't have the same obsession that they do now with water. Not at all. I mean, I, I remember that you, you'd go out, you wouldn't think about, oh, I've got to take water with me because I'm going out. The only time you would really carry water is if you were going camping or, or something and you felt like you were going to need it, you know. But now it's, it's, it's common that everybody carries water with them everywhere. It's a sort of insanity, really. And the, the whole world is sort of pushes into you that you've got to drink so many litres every day to stay hydrated. But and and I think all this is coming in in the last few decades. It's all about selling water, I think, more than anything. It is because yeah. I remember when it came out that came out as mushrooms after a nuclear explosion. You know, I mean mushrooms in a forest, mm. and suddenly everybody had a bottle on them. And because I was fully free of all media, I just lived wild. <laughs> And uh, I said, what's going on? Everybody is having bottle on them, you know, when I went in the town to buy some fruit and stuff. 
I just couldn't believe everybody is sitting on a bus stop border, you know, everybody have a border between their hand, the king and the mm. I said, what's going on? And then I realized, you know, I saw it at somebody's house on a television, you know, drink every day that much water, you have to drink. But nikdo, nobody tell them, English, we were yeah. speaking English. But okay. nobody tell them they are... <laughs> They are like dehydrated, and why they dehydrated? They don't, they don't tell them. Look, you need to drink because you dehydrated because you at McDonald's every day, for example. No, they just say, you are dehydrated. You need to drink. They dehydrate you, and they then sell you water. And now the only safe water is the water from the shop. The water from the tap. Any other water is dangerous for you. So. Watch out, mm. eat fruit, yeah. eat and it, learn. Live eat long it. and prosper. prosper. And learn yeah. how it, what it feels to be healthy. Yeah. And how it feels not to drag that bottle with you all the time. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. we're getting too long. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we're leaving you. <laughs> Bye for now. See you next time. Yes. Mm. Love always. Yeah. And love is the only value we should treasure highly, the most highly. Okay, thank you for thinking about it. Bye. Oh.